Silvergate Bank is considered a crypto-friendly financial institution and in recent months has become the most shorted stock in the U.S. In the fourth quarter, it lost a billion dollars as a result of the FTX bankruptcy. And we saw a bank run of over $8 billion on the stock by the end of 2022. However, when there's blood in the streets, that's when you want to buy. And that's what the smart money has most certainly been doing. Take Citadel Securities for an example. They hold a 5.5% stake in the bank. Or you got Susquehanna Advisor Group, who took a 7.5% stake in the company. They now own 2.36 million shares, worth roughly 35 million. And then most recently, the largest asset manager in the world, uh, BlackRock, disclosed that they purchased a 7.2% stake in the company. So you got all this smart money getting, right, buying low to potentially sell high, right? Let's just look at the monthly stock uh, chart. You know, a little over a year ago, the stock was trading at $240. It's now trading at $18. It's now trading at the levels where it was in November of 2019, where it went public. So this is a this is a no-brainer, right? This was at Bitcoin 60k level. Right, if we think Bitcoin is going to get to 100k, a uh, million dollars in 10 years, what do you think this stock is going to do? Right. But for me, this is an easy double. Kind of just looking at the monthly chart, there is no sellers until you get to 80. Even conservatively. There are no sellers until you get to 50. Let's just go down to the weekly. And you have this, you know, this downtrend line. So this past week you had price reacting to the downtrend line. If you want to be conservative, you wait for a weekly close above the downtrend line. You have you know some minor sellers. at $27. So if you're conservative, you can wait for price to breach the level at 27, retest the downtrend line then take long. You can dollar cost average. You can just buy now, right? But when I looked at the monthly chart, this was the area that I marked off and said we can easily see price get back to $50. But this will actually be the first test at $27. Let's just look how, see how things look on the daily chart. So we had a low of 10.65 just over a month ago. You can say prices respecting this short-term uptrend 
one can buy if price gets back to the short term uptrend right but at some point in my opinion it's going to break higher as, lo as long as Bitcoin continues to trend higher even if Bitcoin pulls back again Silvergate is going to pull back it might even breach the short short term uptrend line but that's going to give you a better entry right again we're talking a stock that was at one point two hundred and forty dollars and at some point the US is going to get more crypto friendly as well so this is easily a double in my opinion and based on what the charts are saying as soon as we can preach the weekly level at 27 probably should have no problem getting to $50 until next time